What is up lovely people? It is me here. Today I'm going to try a brand new product and it's from the limited edition Peripera Rich Peach collection and this specifically is the Peripera Ink Lighting Shadow Palette. Now when I saw this first came out, I didn't see this anywhere online yet so i was really curious to try out how pigmented these colors were and when i saw the colors at first i was like i don't have any of these shades which are so beautiful so i couldn't wait to create a look with it and i did today for y'all and it's this look i'm wearing right now so i'm going to show you step by step how i created this as well as show you some of these swatches this looks so good on the lids and it's honestly the most pigmented Korean eyeshadow I have ever tried. So I'm so excited to show this look so let's get right into it. I am starting off with the second lightest color called Morning Sand and apply this with the normal eyeshadow brush all over the lids and brow bone. Next up, I'm using the color Sparkling Beige to highlight the brow bone a little more. After this, I'm using the shade Mellow Rose as a base color for my eyelids. I'm just using a normal eyeshadow brush for this and I'm kind of blending these two first colors together. We are applying a lot more intense colors later so I want kind of a solid base before we apply the next colors. Next, I'm using the darker brown color called Drive Maple and I'm using a blending brush to create more depth while focusing the brush on the outer corners of the eyes. Into your eyes. After this, I'm using the color Greedy Brown, which is even darker. And I'm using this with the same brush to create a bit more of a smoky effect. Now onto the brightest color of this palette called Orange Crush. I'm using a smaller brush this time and I'm kind of pressing this eyeshadow onto the center of my lids to create more of that pop effect. If you want to have the color even brighter, you can actually wet your brush for this step and then use the same type of tapping technique I did here. Now after this, I'm using a smaller under eye brush and I'm lining my under eyes with this color called Dried Maple to add more definition to my under eyes. Here I'm just using a q-tip to remove some of the fallout from the sparkly colors before I continue to the final steps. Now I'm going back to the under eyes but this time with the shade Greedy Brown for a little more smokiness. And finally, I'm using the sparkling beige to highlight the inner corners of my eyes for that final pop. After this, the look is finished and you can add eyeliner, mascara, lashes or whatever you like. I truly, truly love this palette and hope you enjoyed this look I created. If you did, make sure to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more K-beauty. And I'd love to see you in the next one. Bye!